What could it possibly be? If my calculations are correct, this is a... Hey, Sugar Stars. Welcome back to my channel. ABC, if you are ready to see me make even more Miniverse Make It Mini Foods. The Miniverse I'm making today is the Miniverse Diner Series 2. And as you can see on the capsule here, there are pizzas. There could be a tiny pizza in this ball that we have to make together. I'm seeing here there's ramen. Is that a banana split? <gasps> there's a cake. I'm very excited for this pizza, though. But first, I have to juggle these. Here I go. So here we are at my desk and I have the magic fridge here as well. Let me show you what's inside. I did organize it, but it's a bit full of ingredients. So extra ingredients will be going in this magic fridge. But since it is full, I have not just one, but two fridges to open perhaps later on in this video. So today we are opening one, two, three, four, five Miniverse Diner series today. Let's open them all up and three, two, one, boom. And they are all now opened up. Now let's see which Miniverse we are going to open first. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother said to pick the very best one and it is you. This is gonna be our first Miniverse that we're gonna open. Ah, let's see what's inside. I'm so excited to see these brand new mini verses that I've never seen before. Comment below which mini verses you've built. Do you guys have a favorite series? Is it diner? Is it cafe? Series one, series two. Whoa, this is a new bag. It's pink. It has strawberries on it. We have one, two papers. We have a table. Oh my gosh, I forgot that diner series has the tables. I have so many of these tables, you guys. I'm just gonna stack it here in the back. There we go. Oh, there are so many bags. Hold on. Okay, one two, three, four, wait, are there five, six bags in this one miniverse? Are you crazy miniverse? You're insane. Let's open up this guy first. It says, keep cool. Let's see what's inside in three, two, one. What are you? <gasps> wait, is this cheese? It is a jar of cheese. What are we making with cheese? He's inside. Hmm? Let's open this up. This is flat. Wait, you guys, I think I know what this is. This is flat, but it doesn't feel like a plate. What could it possibly be? If my calculations are correct, this is a... <gasps> it's a pizza crust. Oh, I told you guys we're gonna be making a pizza. Look at the back. It's like all burnt up, like a real pizza. That's so cute. Oh no. Bag number three. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Are those mushrooms? Y'all, you guys, I'm a big fan of mushrooms and vegetables, especially mushrooms. I feel like they're my favorite things ever. And on this side, what are those? Chili peppers, green peppers. We're gonna find out what flavor pizza we're gonna get. Guys, comment below right now. What is your favorite kind of pizza? Is it cheese? Is it Hawaiian? Is it pepperoni? In this bag, we have a... <gasps> Y'all, in each bag, I'm getting so surprised. I thought this was gonna be like a plain white plate, but it is a... Like the thing you put in the pizza oven, like, like you put put like that and put in the oven. This is so cool. I don't know what this is called though. Let's see what's in bag number five. Yes, this is bag number five. So many bags in this one. It is a red pepper flakes, a spicy pizza. Hmm. And then our last and sixth bag is a What's that? So many surprises. It's a pizza cutter. Dude, this is so cute. Wait, are we cutting the pizza? We also have tweezers and what's this? Okay, this doohickey comes with every tweezer and I have no idea what it is. No clue, no clue whatsoever. We have a brand new paper to cross things off of. Let's find our pizza. Ah, here it is. I believe we are making this veggie pizza. First step. We put the pizza, wait, what's that? There's a mat, hold on, I don't have a mat. Y'all, I lost the mat, but let's see. I don't know, I don't really think we need a mat. Well, first we put the pizza, 
on top of the pizza putter in the oven, and then we put the cheese on top and then the veggies on top the chili flakes and then we put it in the oven to bake or we could put it in the sun but since i have this this special uv lamp it will bake in seconds here we go i'm ready first off we gotta open up the pizza like this oh oh my gosh look at that whoa it's so flexible Wow, I dropped my pizza. We're gonna put it onto the little, I'm gonna call this a big spatula. We're gonna put it on top of the big wooden spatula. We're gonna take our cheese here. Ooh, there we go. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they definitely changed these jars to make them a little bit easier to open. Wow, look at that cheese though. The coloring's very good. It's not like a yellow cheese. It's more like a like a mozzarella colored cheese. We're gonna drop the cheese in. Squeeze the cheese out. Wow, we this looks so tasty. Guys, don't eat this. I, I know it looks good, but this is not edible. I do have a, a mini food cooking kit that is edible. Let me know down below if you would like to see that video from me. If you guys heard of pop and cooking. That's exactly what that is. I'm gonna tap it down on the table to get it to spread out a little bit more because I, I like the shape of this. I don't wanna mess up the shape. I'm gonna like let it go, go down like that. All right, y'all, my cheese is now spread out. That means it's time for the veggies. Yummy, yummy. I feel like veg veggie pizza is my favorite type of pizza. Oh, my mushrooms. So just like a real pizza, I kinda wanna just drop them onto the pizza have them spread out guys do you like mushrooms i honestly used to be afraid of mushrooms like literally whenever i see a mushroom i would have like screamed and ran away it was that extreme but now i love to eat mushrooms all the time okay next it's time for the green peppers let's go oh my gosh this is so fun a little tiny pizza so cute that looks pretty good and then the last step is to add on the chili flakes red pepper flakes this is too cute stop this is <gasps> no no okay we're fine we're fine everything's great look look at this i'm gonna i'm gonna tap 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 oh <gasps> too much too much this is good this is good okay here's my oven it's time to turn on the oven and then let's put the pizza inside <laughs> It's done. Our pizza is done. It is now time to cross our veggie pizza off of the list. And here's our veggie pizza. Isn't it so cute? Oh my gosh. What a good mini verse to get on our first one. Let's put it on the table like so and put it in the back here. And then we're going to put our extra ingredients inside of our shopping cart. So we got cheese, an extra jar of cheese going in cinema roll. And then we have some extra, ooh, we have some extra green peppers here. I only have like four, but it's okay. It's still enough to become an extra ingredient for something. I have a lot of chili flakes here. We are going to figure out what to do with that later. And then I also have this pizza cutter. Don't really know what to do with this pizza cutter yet. Maybe I, I'll actually put it next to the pizza as like a little accessory. Okay, Cinemora, we'll see you later. Now let's find out which miniverse we are going to make next. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. My mother said to pick the very best one and it is you. Let's do this one next. Second miniverse of the day. Let's open you up and let's count. One, two, table, three, four, five, six bags again. But we have something different here. There is a little coaster doily little thingy. Let's open up bag number one and see what's inside in three, two, one. It's a little box of strawberries. Y'all, what if this is a dessert? Let's open up bag number two. This must be the tweezer bag. It is Mr. Tweezer bag, but I also feel something else. What is this? This is a spoon. Okay, it must be something that you can eat with a spoon and it has strawberries in it. We are detectives. Bag number three and see what's inside. I see a pink box. What? <gasps> what is this? It's a box of waffle. It says contains one waffle bowl. Still very confused on what we're making. Bag number four. It is a 
<gasps> oh my gosh, I love to eat these. What are these called? I called them strawberry wafer tubes. They're so good. I ate so many of these when I was when I was a little kid. I should do that again. Bag number five. It is a berry syrup. Oh, look at the sun. He's getting slimed on with berry syrup. What the heck? Okay, there has to be ice cream involved. Bag number six, last bag. Here we go. I'm expecting a tub of ice cream. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh my, oh my gosh. Ah, he's so cute. He's a strawberry ice cream. Happy sun creamery. This is a Adorable. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Oh, this will look so good in the magic fridge. I love that so much. Y'all, we are making the strawberry sundae for this one. Step one, we take out the waffle bowl, put it on the plate. We take the ice cream out, put it inside, put syrup, a berry syrup on top. We put the little tubes in. I'm gonna keep calling them tubes. They are tubes to me. And then the strawberry bits and then we bake and that is the strawberry sundae. Let's first open up our waffle bowl. Here he is. Oh my gosh. <gasps> this looks like a real waffle bowl. No, this is so cute. And then we're going to take our strawberry ice cream. Open this up. <gasps> and it's the ice cream inside. There are three scoops. I'm just going to pick them up. Oh my gosh, so cute. One, oh, wait, I have so much ice cream in here. Hold on. I have four scoops of ice cream. So what I'm going to do, since it's very, it's a very deep bowl, put one ice cream at the bottom. And then two ice creams off to the side, just like that. No strawberries yet. We're going to do syrup. We put the ice cream in and then syrup on top. That way it creates kind of like a little sticky layer. Ooh, there we go. Pouring it on top. Look at that color. What do I want to do? What kind of design? Maybe like a, like a swirly? Have it be drippy. Ooh, yeah, like that, like that. And then I want it to drip down here too. Like that. Very good. Let's do one at a time and put these strawberries on very carefully. Let's put this guy right here. Ooh, cute. Let's put one right there. This looks like something you would sell at the Hello Kitty Cafe. Now we gotta put in the tubes. Oh, wow. Oh, this looks so good to eat. Don't eat these, you guys. So cute. Where's a good place to put you? I need it to be in a place with syrup. Maybe like right there? I think I want to put all four tubes, like one on all four sides. Too many tubes? Yeah, maybe too many tubes. Okay, I'm putting you back in the box. Let's also put in our little spoon here. Let's put a little bit more on top here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's cook. And it is ready. Here is the strawberry sundae. Crossing it off. And here is the strawberry sundae that we made. It looks so good. I would literally eat this right now. Let's put this strawberry sundae in the back over here next to our pizza and now cinnamon roll is back for the extra ingredients we got some strawberry ice cream here i got one scoop of strawberry ice cream we also have two tubes two strawberry wafer tubes for a dessert we have a berry syrup for later those are always good and handy and then we have a bunch of little tiny strawberries still into the cart you go and we'll see you later cinnamon roll for to put in the magic fridge we got one two three mini verses left to open okay let's see what we're doing next eeny meeny miny moe catch a tiger by the toe if he hollers let him go my mother said to pick the very best one and it is you wow in three two one Ooh, that one was loud. We got a full one here, it looks like. Maybe another six bagger. One, two, three, four, five, and another six bagger, you guys, with a, ooh, this looks like a bigger um, little coaster doily thing. Not a dupe, which is very good. This feels interesting. Okay, I am so curious what's inside this. In three, two, one, three, two, one what is this oh 
what is this i've never seen a cake that looks like this lady finger cake lady fingers this has to be the tweezer bag tweezer bag and a ooh, what's that a serving spoon thingy a cake cutter i do not know my terminologies okay let's open up bag number three what's in this Ooh, why does it say coffee? Is this a jar of coffee? Or is it like coffee syrup? Why does it say coffee on it? I'm very confused. What are we making? Bag number four. This is a little tiny. <gasps> Whoa, wait, the design on this is so cool. It's like geometric design. What's in this? Bag number five. So many bags in this series, you guys. Three, two, one. What's this? Chocolate curls? This looks pretty good. I'd eat that. Don't eat it. Don't eat these. And then last bag of this miniverse capsule is a... Oh, <gasps> what is that? You can't eat this. This is a ribbon. We're decorating our cake with a ribbon? Y'all, this miniverse series is advanced. They got super creative with all the ingredients so far in this series. You guys we are making this the tiramisu and it looks so amazing no wonder it says coffee on it tiramisu is like a coffee cake right first step we take the little coaster doily put it on the cake plate we take our ladyfinger cake put it on top of the coaster doily then we put our coffee and then using the cake cutter we fill it up and then we put the chocolate curls on top we put the ribbon last we wrap it up with the ribbon and then no wait oh we bake and then put the ribbon okay first step putting the paper on the cake plate we are going to open this ladyfinger cake up here we go is there tape on this this is so so nicely packaged can we just take some time to appreciate how much detail went into this cake package whoa wow amazing okay i'm debating whether i want to glue everything together i think i do want to glue everything together so first thing i'm gonna do is glue the paper oh that's a lot oh that's too much like that this cake is not going nowhere oops i kind of got it on the side but I think it's okay. And then we are going to take our coffee syrup? I don't know what to call this. Let's go. Ooh, what the? The texture on this is kind of kind of thick. You kind of have to scoop it out. Spread it out like so. I need more. I need a lot. Wow, I feel like I'm actually making a cake. <laughs> I'm like putting frosting on it. Now it's time for the chocolate curls. ABC if you've had tiramisu before. Tiramisu is actually so good. It's like it's like coffee and chocolate flavored. The detail on these mini verses is incredible. Looks like they kind of just filled it up. Make a little chocolate mountain. Boop, boop, boop. Ooh, wow. Oh my. Oh my gosh. That looks so good. Diner might be my new favorite series. Huh? I'm gonna use my finger. I'm gonna pat it in. Pat, pat, pat. Get stuck on there. This looks really good. So now we bake. Boom. <gasps> it is done. But y'all, the cake not done yet. We have to put this ribbon on it still. Our finishing touch. Ooh, cute. <gasps> Oh my, do I have to tie it? No, okay, good. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at tying ribbons. I think I, I almost got it. You have to put it on very, very slowly. Yes, it fits perfectly. Oh, it's so cute. Y'all, this is nice. So we got the tiramisu. Let's cross it off. What, did it run out? And this is our finished product. I think it came out so pretty. I love the little bow in the front and I love just the chocolate on top. That looks so yummy. I'm put you in the back over there. And now let's put the extra ingredients into the cinema roll cart. We got, I'm pretty sure I finished this whole jar of coffee. So I'm actually not going to put that in the cart. I will be putting the chocolate curls inside the cart, however. And that is it for the extra ingredients for this one. And we only have one 
two mini verses left to open you guys oh my gosh what are we gonna get next any mini mighty mo catch a tiger by the toe if he hollers let him go my mother said to pick the very best one and it is you our fourth mini verse okay guys make sure to like the video right now to make sure we have good luck and no dupes here we go now will this be another six bagger three four oh this is yep six bags what's this this is another doily this looks like the size of that one back there wonder what it's going to be wonder 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 let's open up this bag first first bag three two one tweezers we got a okay this is a different serving cake thing this is much longer so we don't have a dupe that's for sure next bag let's do this one let's see what it is <gasps> what's that it is a pie tin this is unmistakably for a pie are we making pie what flavor pie what's in this bag bag number four and it is a whoa what's that are these oreo cookies y'all i have no clue bag number four this is a <gasps> pie crust choco pie crust are you kidding are we making a cookie and cream pie no way y'all i'm i won't i'm not lying if i told you i ate a cookies and cream pie every week for a whole year no joke i don't know why i did that bag number five boom it is a wow what is this i can't read oh it says pie filling this packaging so cute i love the the plaid on it adorable and then we got our last bag here what could this possibly be and we're gonna find out in three two one whipped cream Yum, 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 yum. So we are making this one right here, a cookies and cream pie. Oh my gosh, look at that, how the whipped cream is intertwined with the cookies. So we're gonna have to do some designing here. We put the, the, the tin, cookie tin on top of the oily crust inside the tin, filling inside. Oh, it looks like the filling has little cookie bits inside. Cookies, whipped cream, and then bake. Okay, so like the instructions said, we're going to put this on top of that. And I'm also going to be gluing everything together. Can't have our pie flying out of the tin, can we? Putting this inside the tin, just a little bit. So now let's open up the pie crust. Oh, there we go. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I love making mini-verse pies. They're so fun. Where's my other mini-verse pie? This is my last mini-verse pie that I did. It does have a top, and I'm really glad that this cookies and cream one doesn't have a top so that we could actually see the dessert. This is a cherry pie, but you wouldn't actually know because it's covered, but there are cherries inside of this pie. I'm going to bake this now so that everything sticks together. Boom. All right, everything's stuck. Now we may proceed with the pie filling. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. This actually looks like cookies and cream ice cream. Ooh, this looks so yummy. Oh, this is so interesting. I've never seen a resin, a mini verse resin that has little bits like this inside. Oh my gosh. Two spatulas. Well, that's how much I have. It's not too deep yet. I'm going to test out what a cookie is going to look like. If it starts like sinking, then I'm going to add an extra layer of cookie filling. Oh my gosh, look. Look how cute and small. Okay, adding the first cookie. Does it sink? It's sinking a bit. Yeah, look how it sinks. Look, it's, it's going down. I don't want it to sink like that. So this is what I'm gonna do. We are going to bake this. I still have a bit of filling, enough to put the cookies on top of it. So here we go. Trust the process, you guys. Here goes nothing. Boom. Okay, that should be good. Using our leftover filling, I'm going to put this on top. 
of what we just baked. Two spatulas. Hopefully this is enough. Man, I'm, I'm really cooking for these mini verses, you guys. Can't forget the whipped cream here. How many cookies is that? One, two, three, four, six cookies and six whipped creams. So that is what I'm gonna do. Cookies first. Let's put the first cookie down like so. And then let's open up the tube of whipped cream. <laughs> Tiny whipped creams. I have to decorate this very well. We got cookie. We got whipped cream next to the cookie. Next cookie next to the whipped cream. These kind of look like orange slices. <laughs> this looks so cute. Boom. Oh, that was challenging. Let's bake this real quick. <laughs> Into the oven and it's done. We have just created the cookies and cream pie. Let's check it off. And this was the final product. Yummy. Oh, this looks amazing. Let's put it back onto the table over there next to our other mini verses. Let's get our cinnamon roll shopping cart. And we have a few extra ingredients here. First off, we have these cookies. I only have like two left, but that's enough to put into the carts for later. And then we have this whipped cream. Is there anything in here? Oh yeah, there's just one whipped cream in here. So that is definitely an extra for later as well. And that is it for the magic fridge for later. And you guys, we only have one miniverse left to open. Oh my gosh. Subscribe if you would like to see more miniverse videos from me. And let's open it up. I'm so excited. Three, two, one. Six bags again. Whoa, a five bag capsule streak of six bags? Miniverse Diner series is loaded. And there's a fly buzzing around. So if you see him in this video, hi, just, just say hi to him. Hi, what are you doing? Please don't eat that. Thank you. He'll just hang out on the pizza there, I guess. Let's open up bag number one. See what's inside. Hopefully not a dupe, but we'll see. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa, it is chocolate syrup. All right, another dessert. We got like all desserts pretty much in this mini verse. Let's open up bag number two. And inside this one is... Is that a banana? Oh my gosh. It's a tiny banana. No way. You think it come in like a banana peel, but this banana's already been peeled. It is a bear banana. Let's open up this bag, the tweezer bag. And we got in here a, what is this? It is a ice cream scoop. It's so tiny and cute. The fly landed on me. Oh my gosh. It's okay, fly. Just buzz around back there. I'm not bothering you. Opening up bag number four. It is a boom. <gasps> what is this? What flavor ice cream could this be? It is a Neapolitan ice cream. So that means there are chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla ice creams inside this one. That's amazing. Bag number five. It is a... Whoa! Wow. Oh my gosh. You know, I love this thing that Miniverse is doing where they put, where they just make funny looking bowls like this hot dog, the hot dog that goes in the hot dog. And now we have a banana to put perhaps a banana split inside. Is that what we are doing? And then what could this bag be? Three, two, one, last bag. It is a boom whipped cream oh this is a different tub of whipped cream it looks like we are making this here banana split oh i get it okay now i know why they call it banana split because look look how this banana is split down the middle i did not even realize we gotta split up the banana put it into the banana boat the ice creams in 
inside with chocolate syrup on top and then whipped cream on top <gasps> the whipped cream already has cherries Ooh, that's super cute and then we bake honestly i feel like this mini verse has been the most fun because of all the ingredients that we have to work with let's open up this banana <laughs> opening up the banana taking out the banana oh my goodness oh they're cute look how cute that is let's open up Ooh, the ice cream let's scoop out the ice cream using the scooper let me see if it actually like fits oh <gasps> oh my gosh strawberry in the middle vanilla on the left and chocolate on the right so i'm gonna try to copy that i love this so much okay i'm gonna put this right i took the bananas out it was it was difficult so i'm gonna use the scooper to put the strawberry ice cream right there in the middle i'm going to take my scooper and grab the chocolate <gasps> ah, i love scooping the ice cream with the scooper oh no my strawberry is rolling around right next to the strawberry this is too fun this is too much fun i should not be having this much fun with with fake ice cream I'm, i've been fishing for you but i got you into the banana boat cute oh, i love this now it's time for the bananas boom boom cute oh my gosh cute it's like a little pea in a pod the banana bowl makes this so much better like a hundred times better now we got to do the syrup it is syrup time so that everything sticks together and so that we could also put the cherry whipped cream on top oh yes gotta make this look good okay it looks like they really they really poured it so i'm gonna try to do that as well i'm not gonna be too afraid of the syrup Ooh. Oh, it's globby. Glob, glob, globby. That looks weird. Oh no. Y'all, I'm trying my best to make this look pretty, but y'all, the only way I think this would look better is if I put more syrup. I know that sounds a little weird, but it's what I'm going to do. You know, messy? Messy can look good. Yeah, I like, I like the little drip going down here. I think I'll have another drip going down this side as well, just to even it out. Yes! Look at that amazing now the last step is to open up this tub of whipped cream and put them on top okay look at those cute little cherries i have to place them very perfectly on top of the ice cream first cherry on top bam <laughs> bam the last cherry to finish out this banana split sundae boom yes perfect we gotta bake bam it's done and y'all i just dug through the trash and i found the placemat this is actually really nice <laughs> glad i didn't throw it away here is the banana split let's cross it off done oh i need a new pen and this is our finished product oh it came out so good i was a little worried at first let me look at the other side oh yeah the other side isn't as bad either than what i thought it's actually really cute and really nice looks so good on top of our placemat wow this turned out amazing i wish i didn't put as much syrup so that you could see the ice cream inside but maybe if i get a dupe i'll make the next one even better and we are going to get our cinnamon roll cart and put in the extra ingredients we got some ice cream here there's actually one more scoop of vanilla ice cream inside this tub i'll actually put this is so cute i don't want to like toss it so i'm gonna put that in the fridge as well and then we have some leftover chocolate syrup into the cart we have a full cart you guys of extra ingredients so we are going to be opening up this refrigerator you guys, this already comes with mini foods. What am I gonna do with them? Oh my, this is so cute. Wait, new fridge. We got some ketchup. We got tiny waffles. Yeah, I'm taking all this mini food out. We need to make space. There's popsicles. Oh, the soda's cute. By the way, I did get this fridge at five below. If you are wondering, it was, I believe, five dollars. Water. Guys, this is your sign to hydrate. Get your sleigh water. There are fresh apples. Bacon. What is this up here? It's so big. Eggs. Wait, 
This is the biggest box of eggs I've ever seen. Butter. Ooh, this is fun. Cheese. Is that a cow? That's a cute cow. We have salad mix. And then in the freezer, we got some grape and cabbage. Get that out of here. I'll be putting all these mini foods inside this miniverse capsule. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them yet, but at least they'll be safe inside the capsule. Can this open? Oh, it opens! Oh, is that ice cream? Oh my gosh. It's ice cream. Wait, I have a section to put the ice cream in. That's so cute. Oh, and I love this little detail up here. It's really nice. Wow, look at my new fridge, y'all. Oh, cinnamon roll. Here's cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll, we gotta load up this fridge. Let's see what we got. We have chocolate syrup. Let's see if this even fits in here. Oh. This fridge might be too small? Okay, so I can only put some ingredients in here. So maybe we'll put the chocolate syrup into the freezer. We have ice cream. Can you fit in here? <gasps> it fits perfectly. Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. We got another tub of strawberry ice cream. Let's put you next to the Neapolitan. Ah, so cute. We got some whipped cream. This is also very tall, so I'm not sure where this can go. Yeah, this is gonna have to go in the freezer next to the syrup. We got chocolate curls. This can definitely fit somewhere. I think right right there is good. Ooh, that's a nice spot. What's this? Cheese! I'll put the cheese. Um, can I put anything in here? No, it's still too big. This is a very mini magic fridge, y'all. Let's put the cheese right there next to the cheese. No, not the cheese curls, the chocolate curls. Then what else? What's this? <gasps> Strawberry wafer tubes. You can go up here. Oh, that's so cute. Let's keep this going with some berry syrup. Syrup's gotta go in here. Oh, but then when this gets full, I don't know what I'm gonna do. What's this? Red chili, no, red pepper flakes. Oh, you know, a good spot for you would be like right, right there, yes. And then we got some, you look cookie. We got two cookies. I can have like a little dessert portion right there. I think that'd be super cute. Dessert shelf. Ooh, fresh fruit. We have some strawberries. This is actually such a nice magic fridge. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with this. And some green peppers. I think I can put the green peppers. Uh oh, this is actually really big. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna move these guys. I'm gonna put you... Will you fit? Um, okay. I made it work. I did it. So then I could put the green peppers right there. It's such a big box. Oh my gosh for only like four peppers and then the last thing I have is this ice cream scoop I'm gonna put the ice cream scoop next to the ice cream now it's time to close up the magic fridge boom boom and it's closed yay and that is going to be it for this mini verse video you guys i had so much fun making these they were all very fun to do and very cute they all came out so nice i believe my favorite is probably oh man i can't pick a favorite what okay you guys pick a favorite for me which one was your guys's favorite if you want to see more mini verse videos they will be on the side here so you can go ahead and click and choose your favorite one to watch next and i will see you later for the next video. Bye!